Before we get into the video, I do a weekly code card giveaway. That's mostly to the people who comment on the videos. So this week we've got Arne Kwok, Bianca Gobi, Mart Marie de Brain, uh, Rashmi, and Tammy Seagreen. Thank you guys for commenting on the videos, hitting that like button, and also subscribing to the channel. Um, otherwise, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and let's get straight into it. <laughs> Hello Pokey lovers and welcome back to another video. Today's video we finally have our Blissey Pokemon Goatin that we're opening up. And well as you all saw in my last video we had our little birthday special where we opened up that ETB and boy was that insane. If you haven't watched it yet guys, uh, I'll link it up and I'll put one of those little cards at the top where you can just click on it and I'll take you through to the video. But otherwise, we are going to be looking today to see whether these tins are actually worth it. Now, in the first tin, we did actually land up getting a Dragonite card. So, uh, that was the only real hit. All the other cards were the reverse, uh, I mean, not the reverse holo, just the rares that you can find inside the Pokemon Go cards packs. So, we've got the nice little Blissey on the Pokestop, like in the game. And we got ourselves the same promo Pikachu. We have the same sticker book that we've seen through, well not sticker book, but the same three stickers that we've seen every, in all the other boxes. And here are the code cards as well. Alright, perfect. I hope someone gets something really good from these code cards. There's another one for the tin. And let's get straight into the packs. Now, are these packs worth it? Well, guys, this will be the last one to let us know. If we don't get anything in this pack then I'm sorry to say, but they aren't actually worth it. Not for their price tag, at least. Are they fun to open? Yes, everything's fun. Energy trick, fire. Oh, was psychic. All right, so we start off with the Chansey. Zatu. Pokestop. Apalm. Spinarak. Ratata, Wimpod, Pikachu, A Palm Reverse Hollow, and we get ourselves the Blastoise Hollow. Well, it's a dupe. We've already got it. So if someone's still looking for this, maybe you can let me know down in the comments and we can organize a trade or something like that. Still a very nice card, but something I'll have to trade. Cool. All right, so off to a bad start, I guess you could say that. No first pack magic in this box. All right, let's go with our leaf. Nope, it was steel energy. Lunatone. Arvisaur. Pokestop. Pidove. Bulbasaur. Squirtle. Badoof, Onyx, a Reverse Hollow Blanche, and we've got ourselves another Melmetto Hollow. Ooh, this really is not looking good. If it's something similar to all the other packs, then the last pack is most likely going to be something with it. Uh, maybe a V, something maybe better. But at the moment, it is looking horrendous. So again, are these worth it? Uh, probably not. If you want to open up some Pokemon Go packs, then yes, it might be worth it. But if you're looking for hits, then the ETB is definitely the way to go. Let's go with Psychic. Another Steel Energy. Zatu. Slowbro. Lunatone. Squirtle. Meltan. Bidoof. Magikarp. Bidoof. A reverse hollow Snorlax. And we got ourselves an Executor V. So that's a first for us. That's really, really good. We count that as a hit. So that's really, really, really good. Looking good for this tin. So again, like we said two tins ago, 
in the Pikachu, we did get the Dragonite V. And then last week, we actually hit a Bust. So this week, we also hit a V card. That's great news. That's some hope that you at least get something inside of the tin. But uh, not, I mean, you pay that little bit more money. Because the tins, if you had to buy all three of them, that's just a fire. If you had to buy all three tins and then look at the price of an ETB. And then you look at what I hit in an ETB and then what you hit in the tins. It's just worth it to get the ETB rather than buying the tins themselves. The other option is it could just be that me and the tins are just extremely, extremely bad luck. All right, Meltan, a reverse hollow onyx, and we got ourselves. Oh, no way! No, guys, come on, what is this nonsense? My final pack? Oh, no. Come on, you gotta be kidding me. My final pack of my Pokemon Go booster box and we get the Mewtwo V alternate art card this is insane oh okay maybe Blissey is worth buying maybe buy the Blissey packs guys this is insane I'm sorry that is incredible we just got ourselves the alternate art Mewtwo V oh that's beautiful all right all right if you guys enjoyed the video, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe down below. If you enjoy seeing me pull all those Mewtwo's, like even more, and subscribe even more. Let me know what you think about that at the, down in the comment section. I think that's insane. Mewtwo and Mew, my favorite cards. It's one of the reasons I've been opening up Pokemon Go is to get all the Mewtwo cards. And oh, we got it. We got the alternate art. Just wow. All right. I hope you all enjoyed the video. And please remember to keep safe, everyone. And until next time, cheers.